In our Science of the Small series, we see how scientists are using miniaturized technology not too different from what you can find in the grocery store, tiny barcodes that could help detect diseases in people and animals. Barcodes are small symbols that make identifications fast and easy. Now scientists are combining that concept with nanotechnology to create tiny disease detectors. They're manipulating molecules to make unique microscopic probes, nanobarcodes, that could tag pathogens in the human body or other environments. There's many agricultural applications. For example, you can use that to potentially diagnose the infections in a farm and you can use nanobarcodes to trace the bacteria in a compost. It's very much like the barcodes you see in grocery store. With this Y-shaped DNA, you can build more complicated structures. Cornell University like researcher Dan Luo is finding like new ways to structure DNA, which makes the nanobarcodes possible. He's also working on a portable disease detector similar to this prototype. So that we don't have to send a sample to the lab to make the detection. Rather, we can do the detection in the field, or in a farm, or on the bedside of a hospital, or in a, a local environment. Ultimately, it will interface with either a laptop or PDA. Oh, right. Then you can detect right in the battlefield, for example, or in the farm, uh, what caused the infection. And then you can make a decision right there. You don't have to wait. Making nanobarcodes a small solution with big potential.